This week on Studio 209, we take you to the Modesto Red Shield. Studio 209 is sponsored by 209 Magazine. Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of Studio 209. I'm Eddie Ruiz. This week, 209 Magazine partners up with the Modesto Red Shield. That's right, for the Kids Day fundraiser. And we sent our very own Tara Levy to check out the facilities and talk to a couple people. Let's check it out. Kids Day is May 10th, which is a fundraiser to support the Modesto Red Shield. So we're here at the Modesto Red Shield to find out what they're all about. For people that don't really know, can you tell us about Kids Day? Yeah, Kids Day is a, is a fundraising event that we do annually. It's an opportunity for people in the community to contribute to the Salvation Army, the Red Shields uh, programs that we uh, operate here. So about how many kids would you say come to the Red Shield on a daily basis? On a daily basis, we can have anywhere from 100 to about 150. So why do you guys come here? One reason is because they help us with our homework, and the other reason is because we do have a lot of fun. So what's your favorite part about coming here? Well, how much the apps help us. What all, what all do they help you with? Well, kind of everything. How important is it to have this program around for the community? I feel that it's very important. I know it's very important to our kids as well because there isn't anything around here. After school, they're either in an after school program where they focus on their homework, they're not out in the streets risking getting in gangs or in drugs, which is very important to us and the families as well. You know, many of the children uh, that live in this area don't have home internet access and that's something that we provide here in our computer lab. Uh, we help them with their uh, after school homework and even some of the older kids with uh, developing resumes for themselves if they're uh, looking to get in the job market or even college applications. That's available to them also. What kind of impact has the Red Shield had on the community? I feel that we have a positive impact on the children here. We have noticed that the gang violence has gone down. Drug use has gone down. Uh, we have graduates now versus before where they would drop out at junior high or even high school. Um, and now we're seeing that kids are graduating from high school and going to college. People come back very frequently and, and tell us, you know, I used to swim in your pool. I used to play ball in your gym and uh, I'm stopping back in to, to help or just to, to take a look at what's going on today. So you guys are selling newspaper for a dollar for Kids Day. What are some of the popular locations that people can pick up a paper? Yeah, we're, we're gonna be located at, uh, at several of the busier uh, intersections around Modesto and even around the county all the way from Oakdale to Turlock. So uh, look for us on uh, one of those busier corners. Yeah, just all, all throughout the day, right? Or is it only in the morning? I believe from uh, 7 a.m. to 1 p.m. we should be out there. And uh, yeah, if you see one of our uh, uh, news uh, newspaper boys or girls, please stop and uh, give them a dollar and help us out. Don't forget to pick up your paper on May 10th to support the Modesto Red Shields Kids Day. For Studio 209, this is Tara Levy. Don't forget, you can support Modesto Red Shield on May 10th. Just pick up a copy of the paper yourself. It's just a dollar. I'm going to get a copy myself. And you can support us as well by checking out 209magazine.com. All the latest issues, past, present, this one, whatever you'd like. Also, you can check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and subscribe exclusively at the Turlock Journal YouTube channel. And latest issue of 209 Magazine right here. You might want to check that out. Lots of great stories from this area. I'm going to check it out myself right after this. And uh, next week, I believe it's going to be the Houston Fruit Nut Festival. That's right. And it's also going to be the debut of our newest correspondent. So I can't wait for that either. So for everybody here at Studio 209, I'm Eddie Ruiz. We'll see you next time.